everybody, my name is Gina Kim and welcome back to my channel. I do love fashion but as I always say, you don't have to spend too much money to be stylish. So I'm really good at finding really cheap clothes and styling them. In my early 20s, I wanted to experiment with uh, lots of different clothes but apparently I couldn't uh, spend too much money because I had to pay my tuition and I had to feed myself There's a market in Korea called Dongmyo market and there are lots of grandmas and grandpas selling used clothes They are really cheap like under three or five dollars So I used to buy those clothes and wear them at a party <laughs> Once I went to a Fendi show and I was wearing three dollars clothes can you imagine? Three dollars? It doesn't matter if they are used clothes or they are cheap clothes. I never buy expensive clothes. When I have enough money, then I'd rather buy expensive designer bags or shoes. So I got a bunch of free clothes from Zafo. So thank you. So today I'm gonna show you how I wear these cheap clothes and how I style them. The first item that I'm gonna introduce you today is my favorite stripes red blazer. When I found this item, I thought this design is very unique, just like wearing two different kinds of blazers. Also, I like the length too. You know, I'm very short, so I can wear it as a dress. So I paired it with black shorts and fake suede knee-high boots that I bought like two years ago. This is my perfect office wear, although I don't have my office. And I love the earrings so much. They are big, so my face looks smaller. And I love this bohemian vintage style. I'm sure you all can wear this blouse very pretty. I needed a striped blouse so I can wear it with my jeans every day. I love the light blue color and also the asymmetric color reveals my shoulder so it gives a sexy feeling. The sleeves are really wide so you can roll them up if you want. The third outfit is one of my favorites. I think my shoulder and collarbones are quite pretty, so I love almost every off-shoulder items, but I didn't have a dress and I found this one. The length was shorter than I expected, but that's why I was really happy because it's the perfect length for my height. I paired this dress with black leather items. In this way, the dress looks more expensive. This lace-up top is really versatile. I can wear it with almost every jacket. I love the high neck and the lace-up slits make it look sexy. I paired it with these cropped trousers. Here I wore pointed heels so I can look taller and more stylish. I think this outfit is perfect to wear at the airport. And I found the earrings that look like safety pins decorated with fake pearls. This outfit is perfect to wear at the club, although I don't enjoy clubbing. So this time, I revealed my shoulder again, and I didn't have to wear any jewelry at all because of the ring and choker details on the top. Also, the skirt looks really sexy with those eyelets and slits. I think you can wear this top with jeans if you prefer a casual style. This top will make it look super hot with the skin tone color and lace-ups. The v-neck is really low so I thought I should cover my other skin parts such as my legs. So I just paired it with my black jeans that I'm wearing all the time. This outfit is kind of simple, so I wear these gold tone earrings. This time, I wore this top with a fake suede skirt. I like the unbalanced red style and the ribbons on the waist make it look more feminine. 
I found so many people wearing these kind of earrings on the street these days. I think the design is fun and it doesn't look that cheap. The last item that I got from Zaful is the sport bra with straps. I like the military kind of color and I usually wear a white t-shirt on this whenever I work out. So this is what happens after shooting a fashion video. All the product details are written in the description box so please check it out. I'd love to communicate with you so it'll be really fun if you can send me some of your outfit photos inspired by my styling. If you can, please send your photos by Instagram message. My Instagram ID is itsjinakim2 so yeah, please send me a message. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, please do. And yeah, see you next time. Bye! What we do here is go back, 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 back.